Hi guys, Lego Super Stop Motion back again with a brand new video. Today we're going to be talking about Avengers Infinity War. What I think will happen, who I think will die, what I think will happen like in both of them. So we'll start off with part one. And in part one, the opening scene, I think, will be of the Nova Corps trying to defend off this massive destruction raging through the main city uh, towards them and sort of where they're holding the purple gem, um, the power one, that's it. Um, and I think that'll be Thanos and Nebula, and they'll be coming to try and, like, destroy it and get the gem before they go to Earth. I think the Guardians of the Galaxy will hear this and start coming. Um, but I think when Thanos gets the gem, before they get there, I think he'll unleash it, knocking their sh the ship, yeah, of course, towards earth at a slow pace but it can't move away from that course i think he'll then go to where is it yeah the collector's office i think he'll hold him captive for a while until he finally gets out where it is off him then he'll brutally kill him in some form of way get the gem and then go to asgard after four ragnarok i think it'll be asgard will be pretty destroyed and so, at that reason, I think Asgard won't be, have a stronger defence as it normally would. After that, so basically, Thanos is going to be coming. And I think Loki, the Warriors 3, and Sif, and maybe a few other Asgardian troops, Odin will be trying to fend it off. And I think Thanos will just knock Odin out of the way, basically showing his power to Odin. Uh, then I think he'd go to where the... Tesseract is, take that and then he will go to Earth to get maybe the one that Doctor Strange has, he might have one in the new film and Vision's one in his forehead so I think he'll basically, when he gets to Earth I think he'll find the new Avengers maybe with Iron Man uh, Black Widow uh, who else let me think basically most of the new Avengers um, yeah, so I think they'll try and fight him, but because of what happened in Civil War, I think basically they won't be able to stop him. They'll have too many issues with each other, not being able to trust each other. So I think this first movie will be gaining each other's trust. Uh, Hulk and Thor won't be in this part, I don't think. Uh, but they'll lose. So basically, but they were treat. And uh, Vision, he will escape, and so will Doctor Strange. Uh, Ant-Man as well but then I think maybe Ant-Man and Wasp they might follow Thanos to wherever he is uh, but when Thanos finds them I think he may keep them captive as if Avengers come get them come to me now uh, but I think while he's doing that I think they'll send the Defenders instead and the Defenders like Jessica Jones, Luke Cage, Iron Fist and Daredevil they won't be able to stop him they'll basically be knocked down within Maybe a two-minute fight. Maybe even a half a second fight. Uh, basically, they'll be powerless against him and how powerful he now is. So, I think after this, the defenders, maybe one person will die. And I'm guessing it won't. It'll be maybe... I think it'll be someone... I don't think it'll be Daredevil or Luke King. It might be Jessica Jones. Because... Basically, she's a sort of new character. By now, I think she might have had one or two or three series. Uh, so then, after this, I think it'll be sort of nearer the end of part one. So then, they're all like in shambles. Hulk and four have arrived. And basically, at the end of the movie, I think you'll see Agent Coulson. I think they'll all find out he's still alive. It'll encourage them to save the planet. And the next one... I think he'll sort of like, what? So like in the next one, part two, I think he'll start off with the Avengers staring back at Agent Coulson. Uh, after this, I think Thanos will just be sort of destroying at his own will. I think Spider-Man will come in at this part with maybe Nova might be in it by now, yeah. Uh, maybe some other people. And I think it'll allow Wasp and Ant-Man to escape. Uh, as well so then I think they'll go to the Avengers tell them what's happening say how powerful he is and encourage them to come back and fight I think now for maybe a, 
maybe one hour of the movie, I'd say. It's all about them fighting Thanos, Nebula, maybe some other people Thanos knows that will obey him. Um, yeah. And then, I think what will happen is basically, he'll, he won't like, I don't know, but if you know what I mean, it'll sort of like end with Thanos at the knees of the Avengers, a bit like what Loki was. He won't be dead, but he'll be at the knees. I don't think they'll lock him up. What I think they'll do, I think they'll banish him to like sort of where Red Skull is. But when he when they banish him, I think Red Skull will come back, and Thanos will be locked there. He can't come back. Uh, maybe until like Phase Five or Six or something. Um, so then, I think the people that'll die is Captain America, Iron Man, maybe Thor. Black Widow, Jessica Jones, maybe, no, no, not Ant-Man, uh, maybe Ant-Man, War Machine, if he survives from Civil War, because it's not looking like it in the trailers, uh, but I think that's what they're making you sort of believe in the new trailers, uh, but, yeah, so, that, but I think, Wind Soldier, and... Maybe even Falcon might replace Captain America because they both do at some part in the comics. And I think the same will happen with War Machine and Iron Man. Uh, so that's all I think for now, guys. Hopefully you enjoy it. Uh, so, yeah, see you all in another video. Bye. Oh, and don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.